By 1918, America was ready for a faster system to deliver letters. America was ready for airmail. On May 15th, Army Lieutenant George Boyle left Washington, D.C. and headed for New York City with the first sack of airmail. But he never made it. His plane crashed in Maryland. The uninjured lieutenant called his boss to send the car for him. His second flight was more successful. Since onboard navigational aids were non-existent, airmail pilots found their way by following roads and rivers. It was rough going. Of the 50 original pilots, 32 died trying to deliver the mail. One pilot survived several near accidents, earning him the nickname Lucky Lindy. This same pilot took a leave of absence to make a special flight. He ended up making history. The pilot was Charles Lindbergh. All along, he had planned to return to his airmail route after crossing the Atlantic, but the resulting fame made that impossible.